Hey guys, welcome back to BWG. Today I'll be reviewing the Chicken Supreme Pizza from Domino's, as I've got here right now. So, there you go. That's the pizza in all its glory. I'll bring it a bit closer to you guys so you can actually see what's going on there. So we've got pineapple, tomato, mushroom, onions, mozzarella cheese, spiced seasoned chicken, onions, some shallots, just lightly um, put on there. Um, what else? I think that's it. And then obviously pizza sauce. So yeah, we'll dig right in. This was the classic crust, and I already had just a bit of a slice there. Obviously the crust of the pizza is what gives the pizza its kind of um, classic feel. You know, you always eat the toppings, eat the, the meat, like the main part of the pizza, and then when you get to the crust, it's kind of like dessert. Some people don't like pineapple on pizza, but personally I quite enjoy it. Um, feel free to comment what you think of pineapple on pizza on the com in the comment section down below. I'll just have this piece, put it on there. Really small piece just there. There's some problem probably while they were cutting it. That's why there's a humongous piece that hasn't been actually cut properly. It's two pieces but it's like the size of my bloody hand and a bit more. So, yeah, try the fire up. It's pretty good. Get both the crust together and finish them off. Right. I don't know if you guys can see there, but there's steam coming from the pizza, probably because of the light background, you can't see it. But yeah, you've also got onions on there. Let's go for a bite. Right, immediately as you eat it, you get the waft of the chicken, and then followed by the tomato sauce, which just molds around just wraps around the the onion and the mushroom which kind of add the extra layer on top of the chicken and double the flavor then you got obviously you get the cheese on top obviously this pizza isn't too different from the others because the others just have an extra sauce on them or they don't have pineapple on them or what or whatnot but this one's actually fairly good. Uh, I'd give this like an eight and a half, maybe a nine out of 10. The only thing I'd say it's lacking, maybe they should have drizzled a bit of an extra sauce on top, maybe like a creme fraiche or something else that comes to mind. This is one of the new additions to the menu though. So I don't know, they're probably testing it and they'll probably remove it afterwards if it's not too successful. But so far I like it. I would definitely order this again. And I recommend this to you guys as well. You know, I apologize for not uploading too consistently, especially, you know, I just haven't had the motivation to upload and, and, um, and I just haven't been getting ideas, but when the time comes, you know, and I get food delivered, that's when I like to, you know, order new things so I can make videos for you guys. So that's what I try and do. Sometimes, you know, I can't make the videos because... I'm out and I'm eating the food out there and I don't want to disturb the public, you know, so, or make myself, or like, attract attention to myself in, in that kind of annoying way, so. Alright, what I'll do for you guys is, I'll get the slice with the shallots on there, because I didn't taste any of the shallot on the last slice because there wasn't any. Alright, so, we'll go in. So immediately you get that kick of the, the shallots that you have. Maybe if you're putting shallots in scrambled eggs or, you know, a casserole or something like that. You get that kick, then you go straight to the chicken. Then the cheese, then the tomato. 
than the other toppings. But in that bite, there was only there was only chicken, there was only tomato, there was only cheese, and there was only the spring onion and a bit of bit of um, red onion there. So yeah. Now that is really good. What I'll do is I'll leave it all for later because this I've been like dieting a bit here and there. So I haven't been eating as much as I usually do. So I'll just leave it for now. And yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the video and I'll catch you in my next one.